is a field which has no dynamics a priori. So we see that we can choose it to be proportional to a constant vector. Therefore, derivative is a constant vector. So as a result, we will have that this additive term in the action will involve among all the Carroll field additive term. Actually, this is a unique manner how we can introduce Carroll field additive term within superfield approach, within supersymmetry language. Then, by the same group, CPT even, Lawrence Brayton supersymmetry theory was developed. But up to now, within this approach, there were no, there were no examples of perturbative calculations, only three level studies. Third way is a brute way. Here we introduced extra terms in the action, which involve some derivatives of our superfields contracted to some constant tensor. This is the simplest manner. Originally, it was done in this paper by Pospelov. But this manner has some problem that it, it involves high derivatives. We project to components. We see that in components we will have the standard term plus this new term involving high derivatives, first derivatives. We see that we have high derivatives which involve both time and spe special derivatives. Time and special. So besides of usual or rubber like terms which involve only higher spe special derivatives, we can have only also mixed term. Some discussion of mixed term with, without supersymmetry was made in this paper by Sotirio. So. Let us discuss our deformation of supersymmetry algebra. Three-dimensional case. We, intro, we deform the generator in this way. Here we have additional term proportional to a constant tensor k. We assume it to be small. We introduce nabla proportional to the usual derivatives. It is so-called twisted derivative. We assure k to be small. For, for the sake of simplicity, we can choose that it is pro, uh, proportional to a second order in constant vector, which is normalized, time-like, like-like, space-like. Model, it's model of one minus one zero. Alpha is very small. Alpha is dimensionless. Spinner supercovariant derivatives must commute with these generators. So we see we have simple rule how to promote how to promote usual supersymmetric theories to Lorentz Brayton supersymmetric theories. We replace simple derivatives to twisted derivatives. We generate super, super covariant algebra. Instead of simple derivative, we have nabla twisted. We have twisted d'Alembertian. It is also of second order.